Hey, and welcome back, everybody. We have another TTM video to get to. Big video on Tuesday this week, so we've only got seven to get to today. Seven looks like cards. And the first one's coming from Parts Unknown. Do we know any of them? No, we don't. Parts Unknown, the first one. We send our favorite athletes, celebrities, cards, sometimes photographs, sometimes balls through the mail. We get returns. We come to YouTube. This envelope got a little wet. There's Jim Barr. Cards appear to be okay. Autographs look okay. Great picture. Starting on this tri-headed card again. We got this done at least once before. All three of those gentlemen still living, still signed through the mail. Probably got to Chris Arnold next. And four of four from Jim Barr. One of the greatest college pitchers of all time. He and a other pitcher on his team, the name of Dave Kingman, led USC to two national championships. Kingman was a great pitcher as well. Barr was better. Just uh, unbelievable in college at USC. Played 13 seasons in the major leagues, 71 to 83. 11 for the Giants, 2 for the Angels. Only finished 101 and 112 overall record. And, again, two national championships at USC. Seven days, no fee. Always a quick return from Jim Barr. We've gotten him several times over the years. Jim Barr, North Houston, Tejas. North Houston, Houston, Houston. Hey, there's Ray Childress. Saw a couple of people getting back. I forgot what cards I sent. I was hoping I sent that 86 rookie card, but I didn't. Evidently, Fleer 95 and 91 Pro Set Portrait Legends card or All Pro card. Yep. I know I sent two cards, two of two. He has been signing more than two this year. He generally signs about once, maybe twice a year total. So I just sent it out. It's been about two months ago. Hoping for the best. Kind of put that on hold. Sometimes you have guys you want to send to and you just keep putting it on hold and put it on hold and put it on hold and then... I think I sent Carl Mecklenburg and um, Ray Childress on the same day. They Both those guys, really great borderline Hall of Famers who just signed once or maybe twice a year. So finally got that out. He played 12 seasons, 85 to 96. Really great player, like I said. Five times in the Pro Bowl. 76 and a half lifetime sacks. College Football Hall of Fame for his time at Texas A&M. And let's see. Okay, 53 days, 53 days, no fee, Ray Childress. Get him out to him, he'll get him back to you. Might take a year, he'll get him back to you. Indianapolis, Indiana, up next. You got my note back. Did not sign my note. Jeff Groth, first time we've sent to him. 281 tops, 84 tops, three of three. Did not sign the index cards. Quick return. First time we've ever sent to him. Pretty decent uh, receiver. Kind of unheralded. Played on those Saints teams who were pretty bad during that era. Put up some decent stats. Great athlete. 65 years old. And I played seven seasons total in the NFL. 79 to 85. Also got drafted in the Major Leagues. 1980 draft. How about that? Did not sign the note. Just returned it good measure and nine days no fee Jeff Groth growth Jeff growth we'll go with growth lost wages lost wages Nevada how do you know if it's Nevada oh get my note back here too he signed it pretty sweet Tom Mack we saw who get him back math bowler Got him back on that rookie card. 70 tops, 73 tops. I love this card. I've gotten that slabbed a couple times. Probably send this one out to get slabbed. Really great autograph. That's a 10. On the Beckett scale. Let's see, get that focused in there for you. Nice. Hall of Famer. And I wrote, question, how much, was, how much did going up against the Rams, great defensive line every day in practice. Brown, Lundy, 
Olson, Talbert, Jones, Bacon, etc. help you in becoming such a great offensive lineman. The better you practice, the better you play. <laughs> Pretty cool. The better you practice, the better you play. Yeah, he spent every day in practice going up against one of the best defensive lines in history. Had to make him a better player. Put him right in front of Jim Barr, right up front. Tom Mack. Auto focus there. Uh, pretty cool. Didn't even give him any details about him. He's 79 years old now. I sent, um, I think I said five bucks a piece because I sent that rookie card. And I asked a question. He doesn't charge. He'll sign for free, but I've sent to him so many times over the years. He played 13 seasons, 66 to 78. Out of those 13 seasons, 11 times in the Pro Bowl. 11 times in the Pro Bowl. And as he says, Hall of Fame in 1999. Quick return from him as well. Eight days. No fee. I sent $5 each. Greenville, South Carolina. Greenville, South Carolina. How do you top Tom Mack? Jim Ferry. Oops. Airbrushed hat. Thin black ink. And he changed the blue on the rookie stars. We'll get send that out to Jack Billingham. He signs for $5 a pop. Jim Ferry signs for free. Commonly signs the index cards, but he didn't here. 78 year old outfielder. And he played for six seasons from 68 to 73. Dodgers and Expos, the two teams you see there. And that's another quick. I've gotten that card signed by those two at least twice in the past. Another dual card we're working on. Look at the tri card there with the with the Giants rookies. I got that at least twice. This is probably the third time we're going to get this finished. Hopefully, Mr. Billingham signs for us. Jim Ferry's always a quick return. Eight days, no fee for him. Miami, Florida. Forta. Miami, Forta. Florta. Oh, no card. <laughs> Bob Greasy, rookie. Beautiful. No creases. Did not put the index cards back in there. Did not put the... Wow. Just laying in there. Beautiful rookie card. Bob Greasy, Hall of Famer. Gotten this slabbed by Beckett in the past. That's another great signature by him. We have an auto graded 10. Man, I didn't wait my usual six months with Bob Greasy. He only signs about once a year, twice a year. Tops. And he's been signing consistently recently. So I think I got him back like first week of December, maybe. And sent him in two months later in February. Here we are. Got it back again. So he's changing his signing habits. 78-year-old Hall of Fame quarterback. 14 seasons, all with the Miami Dolphins. Six times in the Pro Bowl for him. And two times Super Bowl champ. College Football Hall of Fame in 84 for his time at Purdue. Pro Football Hall of Fame in 1990. And that came back in three weeks. 21 days, no fee, Bob Greasy. Nice. Phoenix, Arizona, last one. Didn't trust my Dollar Tree envelopes. Put a little piece of tape there on the corner. Appreciate that. Myron Patios. All right. He recently moved, got a new address. And that's his rookie card there. Michael, Myron Patios. Signed them both. Inscribed them both. Michael. Pretty cool. And I got my note back from him as well. Everybody send their notes back today. Did not sign my note. But that's pretty cool. He was a really good linebacker as well. Sent to him probably like three years ago. 2020. Early 2020. And didn't hear a word. Then we found out he moved. They said he might be sick or something. He may have had COVID, I believe, early on. He got really sick, so he since moved new address, and we got that back. That's <laughs> It's been out a while. Let's go off the record and count that one up as well. We'll put this one over here where we can see it just a bit better. Hold on. All right, three-time Pro Bowler. Played pro football for 13 seasons, 61 to 73. Steelers, Rams, and Redskins. And he's on the Steelers Legends team. Went off the record. He's from Notre Dame. But I went off the record and counted it up. 111 days, Myron Patios. 
and the one three years ago. Maybe we'll get that back this week. Maybe he's going to clean up all of his mail, even the things that were forwarded from a different address. But that's it. What do you think? Let me know down below. What do you think? Seven returns today, including a great response from Tom Mack, the Hall of Famer, Bob Greasy, Hall of Famer. And that's it for the Hall of Famers. Working on a dual-headed card here, a tri-headed card here. Great return from Ray Childress. Let me know what your favorite was, as always. And if you haven't subscribed yet, click right there and ring that bell, and then you'll be notified of all my future videos that I post. We try to do these at least twice a week. And uh, the way they've been coming in here, I might do it to three times a week. Um, so with 18 returns today, with on the, this week with the two videos, 11 and 7, if you missed Monday's video with 11 returns, click right there and watch it for the first time. But thanks for being with me today, and we will see you soon.